Please welcome our 2016 Rolex Girls Player of the Year from Bangkok, Thailand, Poffinkorn Tavatanikit. Good evening, everyone. First of all, congrats, Noah, on winning your Rolex Junior Play of the Year. It is such a marvelous honor for me to be named the Rolex Junior Play of the Year and to be joining the list of people as successful as Inby Park, Paula Creamer, Morgan Pressel, Alison Lee, and Aria Jitonagarn. I never thought I would be in this position, but it is truly humbling. I'd like to thank the AJGA for providing such a prestigious tournament for all of us junior golfer to enhance our skills and help us grow as a person both on and off the course. Your world-class organization has given us the opportunity to play under the greatest junior golf association in the whole world. I love coming back to United States to play in the AJGA event and I am grateful that I have met all of you. I appreciate the AJGA that they have given me the chance to cherish their long lasting friendships that will forever remind me of all the great times I had during my junior golf career. Next, I would like to thank Mr. Arno Laborde from Rolex for their support for more than 30 years and this great evening. The chocolate is always the best, and I, and I look forward to it each year. Winning the Rolex Ch Tournament of Champion was the highlight of my 2016 season, and I am honored to be recognized by Rolex with this prestigious honor. Thank you, Mr. Bill Huntington and Ms. Kelly Broad of Polo Ralph Lauren. I appreciate your dedication to junior golf through apparel and the Polo Golf Junior Classic, and always look forward to seeing which polo shirt I receive at the AJJ events. To Josh Sparks and PGA National Resort and Spa, thank you for hosting us on two championship courses since 2009. This is one of my favorite week of the year, and I'm very grateful for this opportunity. To my supporters back in Thailand, Thanks for backing me up with everything I ever needed. Thank you, Thailand Golf Association, for allowing me to represent Thailand at an amateur level, and for teaching me how to maintain my sportsmanship within the team. I am very thankful for all your help, and I am honored to be a part of the great organization. To my friends at school, I'm extremely thankful to have all of you as my friend. I couldn't imagine surviving a day with, at school without you guys. To Coach Carrie and Coach Alicia, thank you for having faith in me and my potential as a golfer by providing me with a scholarship opportunity and for allowing me to join the Bruin family. I am thrilled about my future college life as a student athlete at UCLA. Bruce, Thank you for your generosity and kindness. Your selflessness has inspired me to be the greatest person I can be. On behalf of our family, you are so blessed to have your support. Mom, all you've done for me is unbeatable. You might not realize it, but all the little things you do are the key to my happiness. Your love has given me the strength to be the daughter you wanted me to be and I'm really appreciative of your affection. I am so lucky to have you as my mother. Dad, I know you can make it today, but I am thankful for all the things you have provided me as a parent. I am the most fortunate girl in the world to have you as my dad, my coach, my best friend, and my rival. Thank you for your participation with the Snapchat filters in my Snapchat stories. Every day, 
I try not to do anything that might disappoint you. All the beliefs I have exposed to by you are indescribable. Sometimes I really wish you just let me do my own thing. But after the Ping Invitational and today's banquet, something tells me that you're the person I need to spend those time with. I tell you every morning that I love you, even though I occasionally may not act that way. Your big smiles tells me that you actually love me more than I love you. You are the supreme category of that. I love you and I miss you so much. I wish you could be here. As you all know, golf has many complexities in its own simplicities. It's an art. There's no perfection to it. Like life, there's a, there's a bomb in every steps you take. Golf has taught me how to take failure in stride. The last two years have been very rough on me. I've been experiencing hardships in delivering an outstanding performances because I did not focus on shaping my talent. Instead, I was enthralled by other factors that alter my disciplines and dedications. For a while, I was not content about any outcome and wasn't playing happily. In addition, I became emotionally weak and the thought of not wanting to do anything flashed into my mind. I cried so much after the 2015 Yannis Day Invitational because I have a very high expectations for satisfying outcomes and try to perfect every action on the course, which leads to frustration and fury. But looking back to the past, I realized that I cannot be in the position to visualize the perfect outcome if I have not prepared for it. We were in a car traveling to a, another tournament that is coming up, and I was telling my parents about all the things I could have done in the past and how I has wasted so much time and how disappointed I was about my actions. Consequently, I apologize to them for not having enough preparation for their sacrifices. However, I later re realized that the hardships and failures I went through have provided me some of the greatest lessons. They have provided me with an inspiring moral, which leads to the reflection that to conquer oneself, it's a greater task than conquering others. To become Rolex Junior Player of the Year, I prioritize the importance of committing myself to prepare for all the tournaments by working out, staying focused on my goals, learning from the mistakes I did, and keep in mind that if I want to be the best, I have to work twice as hard as everyone else. Through my season, I finally came to understand that you never master the game until you truly master yourself. I also learned that nothing is ever too late as long as your desire and desperation defines your passion to try to seek out every opportunity in front of you. I hope everyone has a tremendous evening at the Rolex Junior All-American Awards Banquet and this week at the Polo Golf Junior Classic. Thank you.